Well, hey guys, uh, I know if you've been watching any of my videos, you know this year, man, have I been working my tractor hard. Not abusing, just lots of hours. So anyway, it is that time of year. Um, I get all of my service done at James River John Deere, which is an unbelievable service. And so anyway, I am all loaded up and I am going to get my tractor in for service. They say they can get me in and out in about a week and they're running great specials right now. And uh, so anyway, mine's due for hydraulic changes, filters all around, uh, oil change and all of that. So anyway, let's get on the road. So I forgot as I was loaded, you know, pulling off, I had the, my son borrowed the bucket uh, as well the last time he used it and I didn't want to take that over to the shop. So no big deal. I just unloaded real quick and dropped that bucket part off and now I'm strapping down. The one thing that I wanted to show you guys, just a, a fun reminder, this is a trick I learned. I've shown you guys in the past. Let me zoom the camera down so you can see is this is such the best trick is once you're done tightening down what do you do with this so you fold it in half fold it in half and then i do it again you run it in to here like so and then push down and lock it and now all your excess can't go anywhere i think that is the coolest trick and i've been using it now all this past year i saw this earlier in the year and uh, man, does it work great. We are rolling in here to James River Equipment, John Deere dealership here in town. This is where I got the tractor from and they have the coolest warranty. Uh, they go above and beyond. This is the warranty through the dealership, but uh, they do a warranty that lasts 10 years on these tractors. And I think I'm in year seven or eight on mine. And so, uh, Anyway, uh, the only condition is, is they have to see it once a year, and which is no big problem for me, because uh, I'll bring it in once a year and get them to go through it and do all the full servicing on it. Once I run out of warranty, I'll obviously start doing it myself, but for right now, as inexpensive as, as it is with their winter specials, it's a no-brainer to get them to do it. All right, I'm gonna get shut down here, and I'll run and get everything checked in, get the paperwork done, then we'll offload. Well, okay guys, I'll check in, paperwork's all done. I'm on load and park it, and uh, they said they'll have it back less than a week. Can't beat it. I don't know about you guys, but I think while we're here, we need to go look at all the toys. As it's so funny when all the ladies talk about you out working on your toy, it cracks me up how they throw that in that category. But anyway, I think it's funny. Let's check out what all they got. This units, both from Woods and from Frontier. Hmm. This is got to be a fertilizer and a corn planter all in one. Two row, it's pretty wild. Sprayer, tillers. Now you talk about the difference a year makes. A year ago, you could not see anything on a lot that was in the construction colors and you really didn't see that many uh, regular John Deere tractors. And boy, it's amazing how they're slowly being able to get their inventory back up. But a year ago, it was a year wait on any of these type of devices if you wanted one and ordered it. And boy, did you have to pay top dollar. 
it's nice to see things kind of sort of getting back to normal with that one respect. So this is 4044, so this is the 4000 frame. This is one size bigger than my tractor, open cab. This is 3000 series tractor, so this is the same size as mine, but with an enclosed cab. Boy, I tell you, with the cold weathers we've been having and the rain, the cab is so nice. And then of course, this is one, the newer version of what I have. And one of the things they've changed is they've moved the gas tank here in the back. And I've had a lot of people make comments to me they don't like the tank back here because you can't swing around and look behind you and look down to see what's going on. This is in the way. They said they would either rather have the tank where it is, which on mine, it's up here, or underneath the deck here. I'd love to hear you guys' thoughts on that. All pretty shiny green. All right, there's my girl. I'll see you in a week.